Welcome to Bloomington Today. I'm Kaylin Clement. Thanks for joining us. Now it's time to bring you the buzz on Bloomington Today for the week of October 16th through the 22nd. Bloomington Public Health and the Bicycle Alliance of Minnesota are hosting a bikeable community workshop on October 25th at Bloomington Public Works. The event runs from 10 a.m. until 3.30 p.m. and will focus on strategy development to make the city a safe and more pleasant place to work. This will help improve the health of all residents. For more information or to register for this free event, contact Nick Mason at 612-986-6096 or via email at nick at bikemn.org. With more than 10,000 acres of parks and natural spaces in the city of Bloomington, that makes for quite a bit of ground to cover. In this next segment, Discover Bloomington Parks, we guide residents through what some may call Bloomington's best amenity. Located at 131 East 95th Street, the new and improved Maplewood Park has quickly become one of Bloomington's best kept secrets. In 2013, Maplewood Park was fully renovated. New playground equipment to accommodate kids of all ages was installed. A new basketball court and walking paths were added, along with a new seating area and grill. The 3.8-acre neighborhood park has two softball diamonds and new off-street parking to accommodate more park goers. Finally, more trees were added to the area, surely making Maplewood Park a place worth exploring. The Valley View Skate Park, located at 90th Street and Portland Avenue, has welcomed skate and bike enthusiasts since June. But on Saturday, October 12th, the park was officially celebrated with a grand opening event, complete with a ribbon cutting by Mayor Jean Winstead. The newly renovated skate park features ramps, rails, and other elements, all under three feet high. The elements were built to withstand the harsh Minnesota winters and remain intact and ready for play for years to come. The renovation was made possible through a $25,000 donation by Bobby and Steve's Auto World Youth Foundation, which included $1,000 from Quality Bike Products and the Trigsted family. An additional $3,100 was provided by Friends of the Bloomington Skate Park. Now, here's something you don't hear about every day. A sea turtle named Oyster has called Sea Life Minnesota at the Mall of America home for the past 16 years. And in early October, the 84-pound endangered species needed a CT scan at the University of Minnesota Animal Hospital. Doctors were worried about one of her flippers, stating arthritis may be impacting her. A representative from Sea Life Minnesota told us Oyster is doing well and is back at the exhibit for guests to visit. They are anxiously awaiting the results of her CT scan. Sea turtles can live anywhere from 70 to 80 years. Oyster is 26 years old. And that is the buzz on Bloomington today for the week of October 16th through the 22nd. Thanks for joining us.